finish, boy. So prank it out the real. Drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, join the family. I only if you rocking with me, cause we live was doing it there. I forgot my intro, man. Y'all get over me on my social media. It's gonna be in the pin comment. All right here, you can just search it up. I ain't even talk y'all head off. I ain't even had a long intro. I know y'all niggas tish man getting shorter and shorter by the day if you watch TikTok. You feel me? So let's just jump right into the video. Y'all see the title. I ain't gonna lie, I'm gonna throw my input on here. You feel me? Like, y'all niggas, I'm gonna keep it to a honey. I ain't finna say nothing nobody wanna hear. I'm gonna tell you exactly how I feel. This is how I feel. You feel me? So let's see what Shotta talking about. I ain't even see what she gotta say. You feel me? Y'all know the reaction live. You feel me? But anyway, let make the video live. Y'all boys, let it man. Let's get it, man. Gang. Um, uh, men and women. I just watched a video. This woman was hitting this guy. I mean, hitting him seriously. Knocking him over the head and he walking away. He just taking the blows and walking away. Taking the blows and walking away. Um, I salute that man because he did not hit her back, okay? All right, so serious question. My mama, my mama told my brothers, if a woman is man enough to hit you, she man enough to get hit back. Hey, off the real. Let me let the video finish, bro. Okay, you got it. I'm a little biased because if my son don't hit you, don't hit him. But if you're walking around and you hit him, what am I supposed to tell my son? His daddy told him not to hit women. But I'm just like, I don't want my son to be like that guy. Now look, now look. Shadi say she respect him, right? Shadi just say, she was, she was hitting folk upside the head. He just walking off. She steady going bing, bing, bing. And he just walking off. Then she say, I respect him for not hitting her back. But then she say, what am I supposed to tell my son? I wouldn't want him to be like that guy. I'm going to keep it all over the honey, bro. You feel me? Because I grew up, like, I got all sisters. And bro, I grew up, like, around nothing but female relatives. Like, I got all sisters. You go to my daddy's side. It's majority female cousins. So it's like, I grew around female all the time. Like, when we used to get into arguments, it's females. You know what I'm saying? Like, me and my sister they had a little bitty, little, little fights, but as when we was little, but it wasn't really no fight. And like, she get swinging or something, I pick her up, slam her, and hold her. You feel me? Like, something like that. And my mama, well, I remember one time I slammed my mama, come out there, you know, my mama, hey, <laughs> my mama from, hey, man, my mama from Baton Rouge, you feel me? So she got that little crazy side, and my mama come out there, squaring on me like a nigga. But anyway, off the rip, it, it, like, the reason I'm, I'm on the other side is because women nowadays, dog. Women, they act so masculine and I don't need a nigga for nothing. And nigga this and nigga that. They so tough and cocky and, you know what I'm saying? They so, ugh. So when a female get the, you already act like a nigga. You already act like you got balls, y'all. You talk too hard, you talk too much, you feel me? So if a female go as far as putting her hands on a nigga, nigga already let you talk, you feel me? If female step outside that character and hit you, it really depends on the situation. Like, Shotty barely touch you. I'm like, hey, hey, watch out. Like, don't do that. But if she, <laughs> you shit don't care. What you, what's wrong with you? You crazy? You better talk and walk. You feel me? I'm, I'm knocking her ass out. I probably ain't gonna keep hitting her, but I'm gonna hit her with one good one to bring her out of reality. Like, damn, that's a nigga. Yeah, yeah, Shotty. What's wrong with you? What do y'all tell y'all kids? Okay, so first and foremost, wow, she's fucking beautiful. Jesus Christ. But let's just say this. Y'all, I don't know why this isn't taught a lot. We teach guys so much, don't hit women, respect women, don't do this, don't do that. But why aren't we telling women the same thing? Women can talk however they want to men. Women can get in guys' faces. Women can fucking jump at a guy, call him a bitch, all this stuff, and what are you gonna do about it? And he has to stand there and take it. Women can hit a man, and if a man hits her back, it's still his fault. What? Domestic violence, abuse, I'm no sorry, count. but if you were in an argument with somebody and you have to hit them to get your point across because you don't like what they're saying. You weak, you weak. You weak, you not built for it, you weak. I ain't gonna lie, I can express myself to somebody and, and know I just, hey, as long as you heard what I said, you understand what I said, that's all I need, that's all I like. We good. As long as I told you, hey, you heard, it's basically this. You know that little saying, you heard what I said, I'm gonna tell you like this, blah, 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 you heard what I said, bro. I ain't no, ain't no need to talk. I said what I said, if you wanna go further, you could touch me and I'm gonna lay up. That's what it's gonna be, you know what I'm saying? But ain't no touching. We gonna stand there and we gonna talk like, that's what it's gonna be, you feel me? Get some therapy, baby. Get some therapy, because if you're not fighting professional, baby, put it away. You ain't Mike Tyson. Take it easy. I'm going to say something. If it's my son and he comes home to me with a black eye or something wrong with his face and it's a girl he's dating, mama's hands ready to eat for everybody. You could be younger, whatever the issue is, I'm going to solve the issue by decking you in your fucking mouth and then your mom can come over and I'll deck her in the mouth. 
because no one's gonna touch my sons same thing with my daughters but i'm also gonna implement my sons this or tell them this shit if a girl keeps constantly hitting you or putting her hands on you you need to leave that is not the girl for you because even if you aren't a guy who hits oh, women okay. eventually you're going to hit her because you're tired of that shit and you yeah. don't want to get hit anymore and it's reactive abuse reactive abuse trust me i know i've been there reactive abuse you can be abused so much that you finally fucking snap and the last thing i want is my son to get in a habit of hurting people or hitting women yeah so ladies the moral of the story teach your fucking daughters to keep their hands to them themselves i don't care how mad they are i don't care what the guy did keep your fucking hands to yourself ladies unless you're ready to get socked in your mouth or thrown against the fucking wall because not every man is raised to not touch women some of these men don't even have moms to teach them that shit some of these men were raised by people off the streets and not to be disrespectful but it's true please ladies stop putting your fucking hands on people unless you want to get that two-piece combo from kfc bitch no okay, cap now look off the real like i said i ain't gonna two-piece her i ain't gonna do all that like female touch you boom okay boom like like really Really, oh, see right now I'm talking out of anger, right? I'm gonna keep it a hundred. On the spot, I might, I might just handle shot it with aggression. You feel me? Like very aggressive to let her know, like, look, you don't want to do that. You know what I'm saying? It depends. That's why I say it depends. If she talking like, I don't, me personally, I don't deal with masculine women. I deal with straight feminine women. You were put on this earth to be feminine. You have feminine energy, feminine, submissive, like. I ain't just say just walk around and be an idiot, but submissive. You feel me? Act like a woman. Y'all be trying to act like niggas and I, you know, my big, you know what I, I can't stand? You know, one of my pet peeves, bro, is when women say shit like this. I don't need a nigga for nothing. I don't need no man. I don't need no. Like, look, shut up, nigga. You from a, you made from men ribs. Like you made of a man. And, and then they want, then they turn around and say some shit like they believe in the Bible. What? Like, this generation is very confused, dog. You know what I'm saying? Like, women are supposed to be feminine and niggas are supposed to lead. And some, the reason some women ain't feminine because niggas don't know how to lead. Some niggas take advantage of that, that role. Like, you think leading is just running over a female and she's supposed to listen. No, you're supposed to lead the right way and your female is supposed to follow. You feel me? So I only deal with feminine females. If you talk too much, I can't be with you. My attitude off the wall, bro, I really got anger problems like my i got this from my people like i can't control it you know what i'm saying so i can't deal with no female that, ah, ah, ah. i can't do that i like feminine females that know how to play their role and just be like you know what i'm saying because i ain't gonna lie shot you touch me and why especially a stranger don't let a female be talking reckless and she oh, i'm finna i'm telling you i'm telling you you're gonna get hit with some some powerful and your boyfriend come tripping he gonna get hit with some powerful too you feel me like no cap so yeah, like women, they gotta learn to keep their hands to themselves. Cause I was raised not to hit women. I'm not gonna hit a woman. But a, a woman is in my face acting like a man. I'm gonna deal with you the way you want to be treated. The way you treat me and how you act, and I'm gonna deal with you like that. Shit, I this is many people transgender nowadays. I don't know if this a female or a nigga. She coming at me, mad aggressive, dog. You feel me? Shit, I don't know what this is in front of me. I'm gonna don't touch me. Don't touch me at, at, at that point. I'm defending myself, point blank, period. You feel me? But anyway, man. For those of you that just be out hitting females when you just get mad and you just abusive, I ain't for all that. that that's some suckers. We don't do that. We don't touch females at all. I ain't with the hitting females. Niggas can't control their anger. You a little boy. You feel me? Like, we don't do that. But I ain't gonna lie. Female swing hit me aggressively. I'm, 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 shout it. Hey, you better have a strong chin. I'm, I'm gonna hit your ass with a mean one. I'm talking about, oh, boom. You feel me? I'm gonna follow through with that one. Little cow. But anyway, man. If y'all rock with the video, that was just something like just to bring to the channel, throw my little opinion on top of that, just to give y'all some content. Y'all subscribe to the channel if y'all rock with me. Y'all drop y'all opinions in the comments. Let me know how you feel. This is how you feel. You know what I'm saying? Y'all drop in the comments. I'm being a reading. I want to see how y'all feel about it. Don't, don't be biased. Don't tuck your tail and think somebody got something to say. And oh, I'm gonna get canceled. Ain't no such thing as canceling a nigga. These are regular human beings. They go shit, they eat, they drink, they brush their teeth, they funky at the end of the day, they breath stank in the morning. They regular humans like you. Can't nobody cancel you. Canceling don't exist, nigga. These people walk around doing the same thing as you. I'm gonna speak my mind anytime, any place. Period. Nigga, that's how I come. I ain't gonna let no other human being tell what the hell is canceled. You did me. But anyways, y'all subscribe to the channel. I gotta bring my boy some models. So now I gotta start the videos, get him in. So y'all gonna take my time and I can't show y'all take my time I'ma show y'all like that my